Okay, today we're going to be cleaning the windscreen of an Aero Piper plane. We're going to start with the inside of the plane and then work our way outside since we noticed there was a lot of uh, discoloration in this windscreen that was on the inside of the plane. So Mark is inside right now applying the first coating of the Acrylic Works polish. And again, just like in any other application, you use a damp washcloth and apply the polish in a north, south, east, west direction and try and pull off as much of the contaminants as you can on your first couple of passes. If you pull off a lot of stuff, simply flip the rag over to another side, maybe reapply a little bit of a polish, you know, a dime to a quarter size portion of the polish, and then continue to use a north, south, east, west direction to remove the contaminants from the windshield. Again. So after he's put on his first coating and gotten all of it off, he's using now a wetter rag and just putting a thin sheen of water on the windscreen that he just polished with the acrylic works. And the next step will be to use a buffing cloth and this will remove the water and any of the other last pieces from the windscreen. And you can already see a lot of that damage was actually on the inside because it's already probably 60% cleaner than it was in the first pass. And this has only been about two minutes of work. What we'll do next is come onto the outside of the plane and finish this screen up by applying the same process to the outside of the screen. And you should then have a completely restored aircraft windscreen that is clear, it's protected, it will not haze, it will not fade. Again, this is a water-based clear product that will put a clear protective shell on the windscreen and will not fade out. Because it is water-based and has no type of grit, it will not leave any type of swirl marks on your, on your plastics, so it's very safe for that application. Paint marks about completed there, so we'll now stop and go on the outside. Okay, now we'll finish up on the outside of the windscreen. Again, he's applying the polish a small bit to a damp rag. And the initial application with the wet rag. And again, a north, south, east, west direction. And the inside came off and got cleaned very quickly. And I don't anticipate the outside is going to be any different. But you will definitely see a pretty dramatic difference between this and the other side of the windshield, windscreen, that um, will make a dramatic difference for you know, a pilot being able to see out of, out, of the, uh, out of the windscreen. So again, he pulled off a lot of stuff on the outside. So that's the rag from the outside and all the contaminants are on the window. You know, some of it's dirt, but a lot of it's the old wax, whatever else was used to clean this over the years. Again, this is an Aero Piper plane. I'm not sure what the year is, but um, this windscreen is coming up to be basically like brand new condition once we get finished with it. Not pulling up nearly as much contaminants as he did in the first pass, so he's almost finished with this particular process. And just looking at that and the other window on the other side is just, even without buffing it, without setting the acrylic, it's already a tremendous amount of difference. Yeah, not nearly as much has come up off the rag this but time. one more hit. So we hit it one more time. And he's gonna fold it, put a little bit of polish on it, dab it down. And again, you notice we're doing this in the direct sunlight, which is what you wanna do with this product. It's always apply it in as warm a surface and as much direct sunlight as you can. What that does, or what the reason for that is because the paint pores are more open, they will deep clean and apply the acrylic you know, very deeply into the surface that you're working with. 
and that will allow it to uh, become as clear and clean as it was when this plane was probably first sold. We're not waxing the window, we're restoring it back to its original shape. So that's a very important component of this particular product. Now what Mark is doing is taking a wet rag and he's going to apply a water sheen to the window, to the windscreen. And just a light misting of water basically which sets the acrylic. And after he's applied that, he'll use a towel to buff this window out to a crystal clear finish. It almost looks like there's no window there. <laughs> it's that clear and that clean. And I hope this shows up on video because the difference between that side and the side we haven't treated is night and day. Wait, can you swing back and actually yeah, sort of swing across yeah. and let everybody... This is the other side that we haven't touched. And you can see that it's pretty pretty dingy. And then the side that we have touched. Is like new. That's acrylic works on the windscreen of an aero piper plane.